Hey, what's up, YouTube? Your boy Reaper, Dark Reaper, once again. We back with another video. I saw a bunch of stuff from the Tekken Talk that I wanted to kind of go through. Obviously, here goes the Eddie trailer. Thought I'd throw my reaction out there. Probably gonna go over my patch notes in a later stream, but I just wanted to get this out here. Boy, Eddie is back. First DLC of the uh, season one pass. So yeah, let's check it out. Feels forever since we watched the trailer. Oh, okay. He's up. Você vai ver o melhor da capoeira. Capoeira. Get ready for the next battle. Oh, the music. Tekken Eight. Okay. New challenge. The kill monger cut. Everybody hated. Passionate heart and cool head. Okay. Oh, he still has a stance. I like how they obviously show. <laughs> Morgan pause here, but I like how they show. <laughs> As you seen it, it, like like this must be some like counter to As you seen his movement. It's actually kind of hilarious. <laughs> but that's good. That's good. Showing he's equally as good. Oh man! Oh, the cancel. Yeah. He looks like he has a lot more variety with his combos, man. It'll be interesting to see how much damage he does. It's game over for you. Like, bro, he's over here dodging bullets, bro. <laughs> That's clean. Nice. Oh, I got the hell sweep. <laughs> Yo, crouch first. Okay. A heat engager. Ooh, the lunge forward kick. Everybody has a running move in this. Oh shit! Nice, nice, nice. This é o segundo jogo. Ah, that's dope. That's dope. It reminds me a little bit of Yoshi's uh, radar. Music's going crazy, hold up. Hey, early access on Monday. That's Monday. April 4th is his release day, so that Friday. Oh, that drip, that the first outfit that they showed, the pre the the one of his presets, that was dope. Alright, I'm gonna slow it down and we'll analyze it. Yeah, he looks super dope, uh, a lot more versatile. Yeah, analyze this. It sounds <laughs> in slow mo. It sounds weird as hell, but let's go. Capoeira. Hold on. Yeah. This stance. This stance evasion is pretty crazy. Like, it looks like he gets way more distance than he did in Tekken Seven off of some of his uh, stance attacks here. That's definitely a new string. Was that like four, two, three, or something like that? Um, one plus two. Ooh, he has like a shoulder now. So I'm seeing that. Like from his stance, after stance, he has the shoulder. Okay. <laughs> that was an evasion move. But like, look how close that was. You telling me she's dodging that? <laughs> it didn't even look like she dodged it, but alright. Okay, that must be like a, a full knockback move. Yeah, his wall combo, or his, uh, his wall carry look a lot better now. That beat pick, is, that just looks so good. Right, that running three. Hold on, look back to that. The running three into it was like like a heat smash. Oh, he got in stance and then did heat smash. So you can so he can do his heat smash from stance. Oh, 
I'm not gonna lie, the music in the background is throwing me over. <laughs> it's game over for you. Yeah, this part was dope. Dodging the bullets kicks the gun out of her hand. Parece que você continua impiedosa como sempre. And she's laughing. <laughs> the personality, I love it. Oh, that is a hell sweep. That's like a hell sweep now. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure what clean hit properties. Um, obviously on clean hit that would sweep, but I'm wondering at range is it gonna be a sweep or Let me check that out. Oh, this was pretty cool. So he has basically a, um, a crouch throw that gauges heat for him. I think that's pretty cool. Everybody kind of has that kind of type of move. This is crazy. So you see, after he gets his heat here, or actually before that, he can do certain moves that make his feet light up. They kind of explained this in the uh, the other tag and talk from like a month ago, but essentially every time you do certain moves, it triggers that effect. And he does he has like a whole, he has like a few different moves that he can do off of that like after getting in this. And there's different levels of this apparently. <laughs> so it'll be interesting to play around with that uh, when he comes out. Got that heat smash, or not heat smash, but uh. Get his, uh I have to look at what I can get the right part. Yeah. Okay. Now that's a new string right there. I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what that input is. Like, like down four one. What if it's like down four one four or three plus four or something? I don't know. That's interesting. That move makes you sideways, so there might be, because you know he could get Oki on some of his strings with the, uh, I forgot what string that was in Tekken 7, but yeah, after this he could do a, this, this move though, this move right here, <laughs> I feel like every, every character in the game has some type of like running momentum move that gives them like a heat dash, so this kind of makes sense that he has this, that's pretty cool. He has a heck of a wall carry now. That's so crazy. Yeah, this rage art is so dope. That's so crazy. <laughs> His design looks good to me. You know, people hating on the hair and stuff, but... No, I think his design, his redesign looks pretty good. Um, his moves, like he, he's definitely uh, Tekken 8 now. <laughs> he has total different moves as the one he had in Tekken 7. A lot more uh, versatility with his combos. Looks like he gets, just judging by uh, this trailer, it looks like he gets a lot more damage from it. A lot of different like stances, like a little, his little glowing feet, the little stance things that he has. He has different moves in that. Yeah, he's gonna be a, he's gonna be a beast for sure. Definitely can't wait to check him out. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Other than that, peace out, y'all.